Here's a standard RV car port, and I want to show you inside of it and talk to you about the various options that are available to you. The widths. Uh, we start as narrow as 10 feet wide, and we can go all the way out to 40 feet wide for a standard car port. Your lengths. We go in five foot increments here, five foot increments, and we can start as short as 10 feet, but I don't know anybody that wants an RV carport that's only 10 feet long. We can go as long as 200 feet on your length, okay? And your leg height. We can, sh we can start as short as six feet on your leg height. I don't know anybody that wants an RV carport that's that short. Uh, this one is 12 feet tall on the side legs, but we can go all the way up to 16 feet tall on your side legs. So let's go over that again. 10 feet, um, we start at 10 feet on your length, go all the way to 200. We start at 10 feet on the width and we go all the way out to 40. We start at 6 feet on your leg height and we go all the way up to 16. You have a couple of different roof options. This is your standard rounded corner style of roof. And it's, it's got horizontal side panels and a horizontal ridges on the roof. That's your standard and it's kind of your lowest price. Side panels. You do not have to get any side panels. Most people want some. Uh, they come in three foot increments or we do a half panel, a single half panel, which is one and a half feet. We can go in three foot increments all the way down the side of the building, okay? That's entirely up to you. The different roof styles I'll show you. This building has, well, it's probably easier just to show you right here. This building has the style of roof that's called a horizontal or a boxed eave. You got an eave that overhangs instead of your rounded corner and the, and the roof ridges are horizontal just like our other carport. We also offer a vertical style of roof where the ridges run from the peak down to the sides. Okay, we can do that on your RV carport. That's entirely up to you. Once your carport length goes beyond 35 feet, you only have a vertical style of roof option, which is not this one. That is a, I'll go back inside this one to show you. Once it goes past 35 feet, the only style of roof you can get is this vertical style of roof, and it's a little bit more expensive roof, okay? So, if you're interested in an RV carport like the one I just showed you, all you need to do is take a look at this video description, and in the video description, I'll have my phone number, give me a call or text, I'll have my website. You can go there and look at all the various metal style buildings that we have, click on one of those, and it'll pull up my 3D Builder app, where you can customize it right there on your phone screen, your tablet screen, or your laptop or computer screen. Now, if that's a little bit too high tech for you, just give me a call or a text. Tell me the kind of building you're interested in. Tell me the size dimensions you're interested in and what surface you want to mount it onto, dirt, gravel, asphalt, or cement. As long as you provide us with the level surface, we will install that building on that surface. And I'll build out that price quote, call you back, email you back, or text you back with the price information, okay? It's really, really simple. If you have any questions, you know how to get a hold of me. Have a good day, bye-bye.